What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video and today to begin with uh, I'm really sick and I'm losing my voice. If I sound weird at all then that is why. Anyways though we are going to be talking about the brawl talk that came out today and like I kind of predicted like yesterday I had a feeling that the update might be pretty big just because like they've never done this before where they release an update two weeks after something else so I had an idea that they might have been working on something in the background and I think that was right because this brawl talk definitely has a lot of things in it that I wasn't really expecting. But let's just jump right into the first thing, which is a new brawler named Sandy, and he's a legendary, which means he's going to be really hard to get, or you're going to have to spend money to get him, so I don't know how I feel about that, but he seems pretty cool, but he doesn't really seem all that fun. I mean, his super seems really fun to play, but his normal attack is kind of boring. He doesn't really seem that diverse, but the radius on his super is, like, insane. So I don't know if I want to get him right away. I might wait a little bit to get him, but all around, I think he's a pretty cool brawler, but he's nothing that special. Next is the Alpre. Primo remodel and like I mentioned yesterday I actually got meteor rush so in a few days like once I get my voice back then I'm gonna be making a video with that thankfully the El Rudo skin in my opinion is the best one so I already have that so I can use that and I can use meteor rush and everything like that with the new remodel I think it's gonna be pretty cool but I don't know when the updates gonna come out if I wanted to make a guess it would probably be in two or three days because tomorrow the youtubers will probably have more sneak peeks to put out so we probably won't be seeing it tomorrow but we might if not then probably in two or three days besides those there's a few new skins that i don't really care about because i don't really play gene and i already have beach brock but i have another skin that was more expensive that i like more anyways for summer jesse i actually like the projectile but the thing is i have that skin on my main account and not on my mini which my mini and my main account are kind of swapped right now because my mini is above trophies in my main account and i have more brawlers on my mini so at this point my main account is my mini and my mini is my main they kind of swapped i don't know why i stopped playing on my main in the first place but i do like the the projectiles on the summer jesse i think it's pretty cool and now we're gonna talk about probably the biggest thing in the entire update the two new game modes which one of them is lone star which we're gonna get into first i think that this is gonna be a pretty awesome game mode one thing that i'm really hoping for is that it isn't ticketed or anything like that i'm hoping that maybe they can make like another slot for those two modes and then those two new modes can just rotate and then we can get like one more star token every day or something like that at least just don't make them bog up the rest of the slots because that would be kind of annoying but i'm actually really excited for Lone Star just because it's finally another single player game mode that you can finally just play hopefully whenever you want to like I said hopefully it's not a ticketed thing but depending on how many players there are I'm kind of wondering how the trophy thing will work if it is a trophy game mode like if there's 10 brawlers if you come in like fourth place will you get like one trophy and then like second place maybe eight and then you know first place maybe 10 or something like that I'm not really sure how that's gonna work but what I think is gonna happen is there's gonna be 10 players and it's just gonna do exactly that like fifth and up will get like maybe maybe one to ten trophies and then six and down will lose trophies that's maybe how it's gonna work I don't know though and then we have takedown which is another single player mode though I don't know how I feel about this one just because it seems like it's gonna be really meta dependent because if you play as a brawler who can't deal that much damage then you're pretty much guaranteed gonna lose just because like other people no matter what will have better DPS than you so it's gonna be really meta for the high DPS brawlers that's what I'm thinking though maybe it can turn out a little bit different but in general I feel like it'll be really meta dependent for brawlers who have a lot of damage and for brawlers who don't you just can't play them in the mode otherwise you're gonna lose automatically if i had to pick two favorite things about the update definitely the el primo remodel i don't really know why that's one of my favorite things but i really like how it looks and i think it's a really awesome remodel and el rudo looks pretty sick and my other favorite thing is the lone star game mode just because it's finally another mode that hopefully we can play all the time like i said before i really like playing solo showdown just because i don't have to rely on other people and another thing about this mode is that people can't team because you need the kills you don't need the kills in showdown but you can kind of wait it out with a teammate in showdown and this you can't wait it out you have to get kills as fast as you can so teaming definitely shouldn't be an issue and if it does then i've just lost all hope in this game's community but maybe we'll finally have a solo game mode where there's no teaming i'm actually excited for that anyways i hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you made it this far into the video then make sure to tell me your opinion on the update and your top two favorite things in the entire update i know my voice probably sounds really weird right now but i can't do anything about it like i I'm projecting myself as much as I physically can without my voice absolutely dying. Anyways, again, I hope you guys enjoyed. And with all that being said, I will see you guys later and have a good night.